Hey everybody, this is Andy Melba, and this is going to be a short video on how to copy screens from one activity to another in Desmos Activity Builder. If there's computation layer on another screen that you really like and that you don't want to create it yourself, this is an easy way to move that into an activity that you're creating. What you're looking at on the screen here is kind of like a little bit of a four-step process that, that is pretty easy to do. First of all, I want to open the activity that I want to copy from. I want to find the screen that I wish to copy. You can also do this multiple times with multiple screens. And just to the right of the words student screen preview, you want to click on there's an icon there that allows you to copy. And then you're going to simply paste it into your activity. So let's actually go through one of these together. I'm going to exit preview mode here. And in this activity, I've got two slides. And I want to add a third slide that I've already got in another activity that's got some pretty cool computation layer in it. So I want that to go right after this slide number two. So what I need to do is simply go to the other activity. I've already got it open. And in this activity, it's called computation layer. I have a whole bunch of different slides here, different computation layer features. Let's say I wanted to choose this slide number five that says angle rotation reveal, and I want to copy it into the new activity I'm doing. Well, I'm simply going to click on this to go into preview mode. Here's the slide. And just up here to the left, you see student screen preview, and then there's this little copy to screen icon. You're just simply going to click on it. And it basically copies this screen, everything that's in it, including the computation layer, and now you can go back to the activity you're editing or building, and you can simply use Control V and paste it in. And you'll see up here, I've now got this third screen in here. It's this angle rotation reveal. And you can see there are several components. And you can see that also the computation layer gets copied over with it. So if this is something I'm not willing to reproduce all on my own, it's just an easy way to copy it. And let's see if it actually works in my activity. We're asked to pick an example of an angle in each quadrant. We'll just do one of these. Let's say I pick a 60 degree angle in the first quadrant. And yes, indeed, it is functioning correctly. It is running as an interpretive feedback type of screen. So that's it. That's how you can copy from one screen to another in Desmos Activity Builder. Thanks.